Welcome back. To Negatron. So I guess we'll just keep on going right now. My my hope was to whoops, that's not where you need to go. My hope was to explore Jimmy's house, but I'll have to jump on these rafts to cross the river. Go wait over there, boy. Hopefully we have some checkpoints here. This is a real interesting exhibit. What kind of glue was that? I have a tendency to accidentally talk over Jimmy. Unfortunately, this game doesn't have subtitles or anything. The tendency of Jimmy to overjump things really concerns me. This platforming is very scary to me. Can I not pick that back up? Okay. It looks like the platform that was really generous, so maybe anyway, I don't have to worry too much. I want to see a speedrun of this game, where someone actually like platforms this game with great precision. Like this. What is Goddard doing there? I know Goddard. I could have gone treasure over there. Oh, oh not quite. Oh, I'd better try that again. Platform? There you are. Oh, the wrong time to jump there. <laughs> I I wish I didn't keep my speed when I respawned. That makes things a lot harder. That's weird. I run slower on that thing. Oh, I'd better try that it's really again. nice that every platform's a checkpoint because I sure need it. I guess I could pick stuff up over there. I want it actually. Let's try that out. Uh -oh. Oops. Let's try that again. Where am I now? I guess you could slow down on this thing because that helps you not fly off the platform when you jump. So that is back there, though. This is a game that rewards exploring, so let's explore. Even if we can't explore our house, unfortunately. Only 50 points. That could have been a lot nicer. Yeah, it's weird. You actually don't keep running at all when you land on these platforms that move. Other platforms you certainly do. Yeah, okay, that's how I stopped. It's weird, I don't expect to just lose all my momentum that way. Either way, I'm messing with my head. I lose all my speed or... None of it. If I expect it... Losing all my speed is actually fairly convenient. So I don't fly over things. I don't think I can make that jump. If I can, it's a tricky one. I'm not going to do it. Doesn't seem worthwhile. What are things flying around in here? I guess they're dragonflies and whatnot, but it's some real dedication to an exhibit. see that. Well, look at that cat mummy. There it is. I guess got it up. I can appreciate cats. I don't remember being here. Restrooms. I prefer the restroom. That sounds a lot wiser of a choice. Can't go on that one. That's not the man's. Wait here. I'll be right back. Ah, 
much better. Now let's go. Okay. Well, that's done. And I feel like if this museum is as dedicated as we've been seeing so far, a sandstorm exit will probably be an actual sandstorm, and that sounds like a wonderful thing. What's with these switches, though, to, to open doors up and what? Hello? Not. Is there a wall that I'm stuck on now or something? That was odd. I got stuck on something for a second there. Somebody's been changing the exhibit. Then I know who. Okay, on past these whirling dust storms. I don't know, I've heard pretty good things about this place. I'm willing to believe that they actually put this in here originally. Oh god, the game cannot handle that is to say. The virtual machine cannot handle this. Okay, well, never mind the speed. You don't need it. There might be stuff in the walls here that you can pick up, but I don't need it. Oh, darn. Lower visibility does not help. I think you get... Ah. Can't tell precisely what the moon patterns are, please. Yeah, I think. Yeah, they suck you in. Ah. Really hard, too, if you get close. type of thing on this side? Oh well. Does this come too? No, okay. Sphinx. There's the Sphinx exhibit. That's the whole thing. Wow, look at this! From the looks of it, I guess this is a color-coded lock. I'll have to take those gems, put them in the mouths of these lions, and make the color of this light beam match the color on the door. Okay. Testing your color knowledge. What are these guys doing here? I don't know, but I'm going to take them. Video game logic. We have multiple. Okay, fine. Is that orange? I guess it's actually orange. Thought that was red. Okay. In case you weren't familiar with all the all your different color combinations, this is a comprehensive exam on each of them. All your secondary colors. Beautiful. Finally, the pyramid! And there's Miss Fowl. Wow! Help me, Jimmy! Hang on, Miss Fowl! I'll be right there! Maybe. Or if I can't get there in five minutes, we might have to wait another week. We'll see. Oh, this one looks like a lot of platforming. That's a joy. All right, we'll Which makes it go fast, apparently. Which is kind of weird. It's almost very, very temporary. An egg beater. Are there other items though, that actually give me immediate effects like the purple floor? I don't think so. I mean, they're of course they're the red neutrons that can eat points. Rubber band. That's interesting. How some items have effects, and others I don't think do. Anyway, 
is. We've explored the perimeter here. I guess it's time to head on up. Honestly, it seems to me like Negashon really improved this place. But it wasn't like this originally. Oh. Why not? Maybe even easier. Well, that's not very helpful in the... There we go. It's in a place that doesn't let me pass. It's not very helpful. Oh, man. Get on and start, Jimmy. Zoom. I was, to say, I was about to say, I imagine there's some stuff in here, in these little corners. Appreciate that alone kills me, because otherwise I'd have to repeat this platforming. Ta-ha! Jimmy is not subject to physics. Not traditional physics, anyways. There's probably treasure on inside of all of these. You guys should be looking at them. Yep. Yeah. Go, Jimmy, go! Time travel, great Goddard. It's like safe days. Of course, that's not how it really happened. And really, there won't even be much point in having state safe states in this game. It, you get three tries on every individual jump anyways, which I'm perfectly fine with. Anyway, a little nook that didn't have something in it. That feels like a, just a way of using up my time if I keep trying to look into all of these. Because it does slow me down a decent bit. And we can manage. Too crazy here. So I imagine the activator though for each type of power up only appears if you collected the stuff needed to actually use it. So that's one reason one to look around and pick stuff up. Two, it actually makes the order you play levels an important, I guess. Because I never saw the, the jump power up, for instance, in Jimmy's neighborhood because I didn't pick up the stuff for it yet. I imagine. The swinging physics in this game, by the way, are actually pretty good. I appreciate that the game shows help on how to swing every time I do that. You know, if it's only for a fraction of a second. Jay jumped a little late there. Alright. With only about a minute to spare, I think we're going to actually save Miss Fowl this week. Yeah. Of course, Scott could be helping out too, but I guess that's just not his thing. He just likes to watch. Almost there. This game's really generous about letting you land on things. Sometimes it doesn't look like I made a jump. I'll just pull this lever and get you out of that thing. No! Wait, Jimmy! Are you sure that's the level for Friday? Sorry about that! I figured. Have you seen a boy who looks like me, but with a goatee and a sinister laugh? Why, yes, Jimmy. I knew that couldn't be you. He's caught in trouble all over. Finally, someone who believes me. I always have, Jimmy. Now go find that other boy genius. I will, Miss Fowl. See ya. <laughs> all right. I'm getting smarter every day. Maybe it's just your total score that this ranking is based on. I guess that's what it is. Are you cleaning your room? Can I be in my house now? I really want to be in my house. That's like my greatest wish. I cannot be interrupted with such trivial tasks. I can't 
clean. There's nothing evil about cleaning. I got James Isaac Neutron. Are you even listening to me? Yeah. Parents, Jimmy. Oh, sorry, Mom, Dad. You know, I don't think we've been spending enough quality time together as a family. What do you say we all go to the museum, hmm? Oh, don't you try and change the subject, young man. I don't know, dear. Yeah, maybe we could use an outing to the museum. I think I can arrange that. <laughs> Go back to the house. I'm having fun. Bye, Dad. Bye, Mommy. <laughs> okay. Okay. That wasn't very funny. But I pressed for time. Bye bye. James Isaac Neutron. Hey, Mom. Dad. I'm going to get you out of there. You are in a lot of trouble, young man. Why did you put us in here? I'm really sorry, but I'll explain later. What's that button in the cage for? Uh, you said before that this button opened something else, but not this cage. Wait a second, I think I can uh, hit the switch from here. Ow! I got it. Look! That button opened some sort of panel. It looks like keys go into these holes. Great. Now all I have to do is go find them. I'll be right back with the first key. Well, well, maybe give me a week or so. I'll be back. Hopefully next week we'll get to see the house or something, or wake up some solution to that. I don't know what happened, but uh, we'll see. Also, let's actually save the game now. I should probably start doing that. There we go. Hey, everyone. <laughs>